What's up, everybody? Uh, as hard as this is, this as in uh, committing to film what we're doing, because I just want to do it. But we want to share this with those who care, so we'll get used to it. I think that's how they all, everybody that does a vlog ends up getting there. So we're going to go, we set up a new um, rotational paddock for the calves. Uh, down by the trees and the garbage pile, which gets moved on Saturday. Um, so down by the, down there we've set up a new paddock. Uh, lots of grass, lots of good green grass. We're gonna put them down there. They're gonna clean that up for us. Uh, Ella's gonna be our camera girl. This is her new family job. She's good at it. So we're uh, moving up from here because they're running out of feed move them down there they got a lot more feed but we've got to move the electric uh am i walking too fast no you're fine we've got to move the electric down there first and we're going to bank on oh, okay. yeah they did a good job all right panel is off Violet, are you a hungry girl? Are you a hungry girl? So I'm gonna put this clamp on so it makes it easier to hook up our hot wire. And uh, Jessica's gonna put her lead back on. So we're gonna, we decided what we're gonna try to do is take the electric panel down there and get the other one set up first. And then we'll move them. Uh, afterwards, so just in case they take off, we decided to put her lead on so at least they have something to grab at that chase We had to do that when they were first delivered. Violet loves Jessica. Myra, is it Myra? Yeah. Loves nobody. She's the one in the bathroom. Okay, look, babe, so now. Hook it up. Just go to the metal clamp. Boom. Watch out, Goose. Boom. Watch out. Don't touch it. Save your life, bro. He touched it. It didn't. He he was like this close to touching it. It pulses. Well, I saw his nose touch it. Yeah. Last night I was watching these lights. Layla, I need you to carry that orange thing down here. That right there. Okay. Yep. Because I gotta put these in down there. Okay, so we're going to the truck. In, out, in, go. Much better this time. Yep. Two, go. I can tell out. you one thing though, on their phone, it's very clean. Ooh, painful. Two. 
No. But I don't like it. Sit back. Sit. 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 Just sit. So your plan is tying them to this? Yep. Can I sit in the back? Yep. That's the perfect spot for you. Like I don't have, I don't taste any treats. What? One of them I don't recommend. Touching it? Touching it. Oh crap. So what we should see here is these lights flashing and they're not. So, so what that on. means is uh, I've now got to clear the fence.
cats everywhere, so I need to be careful. But I dented this whole part. <laughs> Can I give it a try? Yeah. That one. I broke some glass over there. It was a, there was a vending machine light. Oh really? Let's go check out what my dad is up to. Hello, you should get this whole thing. So, we've got about 2,000 volts going through the line when we should have about, well, at least over three. Um, so, there's too much brush touching the wires. And that is causing the disconnect in the level of volts. Oh, too much grounding. So, I'm clearing some of this brush. I wish I had a commercial weed whacker, but we don't. So I'm clearing some of this brush. What is it? Check her out. She's buried in grass. Which one? I really can't see any of them. So we uh, have about 200 feet of garden hose, and you don't need that much at one point because they're only going to be here for, I don't know, in this place they might be here for three days. They're small calves. But we'll watch it and then uh, we're moving to another section here in the next few days. So we're probably going to be able to get away with this in one spot. Because what I might do, baby, is just move it off. That's good, yeah. And then in the next, after we do this next pasture, I'm going to take them over there under the trees and up on that hill. And by then, that trash is all going to be gone. Hopefully. Yeah. I can draw. I can draw. Cows are moved. That task is done. They'll be there for a couple days. Now I'm moving back on to a project I started yesterday. Uh, the project yesterday was building stairs down to the creek so that we can uh, conveniently access the water to water the trees, which the girls are doing right now. So the uh, previous owner, you know, two things can be true at the same time. He, even though he left us a whole bunch of crap, like piles of asphalt or this mountain of junk, we paid for that. That was convenient. But he also left us um, all of this lumber here that uh, he cut from the beams that are in the house. And he left the racks. So I'm going to use this lumber and my chainsaw to 
build some stairs. What? You guys got them done? Did you tell them you love them? Great, thank you. So, uh, I started stairs, put these boards in temporarily. I'm gonna end up widening these stairs because I wanna go a full foot width on the stairs. So I'm gonna chop these up into steps. Put it down here. Let's do this. Cows are chilling. Loving this grass. Hi huh, girls. Hi huh, girls. Oh, pretty excited to be able to move them over here. It's pretty steep terrain. I don't know if you guys can tell. But with this Premier One wire adapt pretty well. Hey girls. We gotta leave her halter on because she's a pain in the butt. Tree's got water tonight. Positive affirmations spoken to each one of them by my children. Because that's how we do it. We've got socks hanging from the trees to deter the deer. There's a, uh, uh, what do you call it? Irish Springs chunk of soap in each one of them. And this is where I've got to for the day so far. It's time for dinner. I walked that way because they're all, they all have these major overhangs that I've got to figure out how to shore up tomorrow. But we'll get there. And then I'm planning on putting a little pallet deck right here so that the girls can get in and out of the water and we can come down here and not get muddy. It's a cool little spot. I think that's a Russian olive. There's big old Russian olive dirt growing right there. So we moved the cows, set up their new paddock, got their water moved, got, I'd say 50% of the uh, steps done there. Gonna do quite a bit of uh, quite a bit of mud packing, I think. I think I'm gonna pack the stairs underneath of the steps. I think I'm gonna pack them with um, mud and stones from the river. The mud we have here is pretty, uh, geez, sitting on so much junk. 
The mud we have here is pretty, uh, got a lot of clay. So I think it'll work with the stones. So part two coming up.